We've got a we've got a question in from our chat room uh, for you. Um, All right. Someone wants to know uh, a little bit of advice on trying to get a tattoo from a quote unquote a lister. Uh, oh, I'm sure gosh. you get that kind of question a lot. How do I get tattooed by you? Uh, do you have like a general uh, general? Well, every artist that? says their every artist has their own way of handling their waiting lists. Uh, I don't really have a waiting list per se. I just uh, actually I've got a new contact link that uh, is at my brand new uh, website, Um uh, where you can submit your, your ideas for your projects. And I kind of choose it based on the projects themselves, how it's worded, how you sound, you know. I mean, I figure I have to spend, you know, three, four, six days sitting with somebody. So, uh, you know. Don't be a crazy stalker. I hate to say this, but, it, well, yeah, you know, I mean, just, uh, I, I would rather work on somebody who's, obviously thought about what they're getting done. They've obviously um, got some, maybe a little experience as a collector. Uh, I uh, don't only work on tattoo artists, but I definitely enjoy working on other tattooers because there's such a solid foundation of mutual understanding that, you know, when you sit down to tattoo a, another tattooer for three or four days in a row, um, you're definitely going to have a lot more to talk about. Uh, but I do work on non-tattooers as well. Uh, people who have good ideas, who articulate them well, who come across as sounding um, articulate and somewhat interesting and not like too much of a meathead. Um, <laughs> I think that's, uh, you know, that's, re uh, that's reasonable criteria, I would say. You know, that's, uh, you know, don't be a dick and uh, have really great ideas. Yeah, no, as, as far as like... You know, with me or with other artists, it doesn't hurt if, if you tell me, oh, yeah, I've collected from these other people. Yeah, I've got work from Mike Cole and Eddie Deutsch and, and you know, uh, that tells me that you're a serious collector and, uh, you know, I might be more interested in, in putting a piece in that collection, knowing that it's going to be next to this other uh, really stellar work. And I know I'm not the only, quote, unquote, A-list artist who feels that way. So you know, demonstrate that you're a serious collector. And even if this is the first tattoo you've ever gotten, if it's a great idea and you uh, explain it well and you come across, uh, you know, as, as being somebody that one of these artists might actually want to sit with for those few days, uh, and that's, that's the number one thing. Um, that's great advice. You know, beyond that, uh, yeah, drop names. There's nothing wrong with dropping names, people that you've collected from. Uh, you know, if if there's if you've got a really messed up old tattoo collection and you're you're trying to get one of these A-listers to fix it up, that that might be a little trickier. I do get a lot of that, um, and usually in those cases, I'll I'll ask you to go on the difficult and painful uh, journey of getting yourself lasered. Um, I just don't see why either of us should waste our time. Otherwise, you know, that just doesn't make any sense. Um, you're going to get in a, a situation where you're waiting a year for an appointment, you might as well get that puppy lasered. Uh, you'll be able to do more with it. It's not really going to cost you that much, uh, you know, compared to the way it was back in the day. I mean, lasering these days is a lot more reasonable. And um, you won't have to sit as many times with me or whatever artist uh, ends up doing your cover-up. Um, I, I can't tell you how many times I've had people contact me. Yeah, I had this sleeve started. It's outlined. It's kind of ripped off from your work. Uh, the guy that started it, well, he and I don't talk anymore. I'm wondering, can you turn this uh, gnarly, badly planned uh, outline into a masterpiece? Um, no. No offense, but no, no, I can't. Uh, <laughs> no, just, just straight up no. But if if you're if you're willing to show you're serious and get lasered and uh, you know return your skin to a state where actually something nice can be done with it. Um, then myself or some other quote unquote A list artist might take it seriously and, and do it. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, that's my advice. That's great advice, and uh, I hope that answered their question. Mm -hmm.